Hey guys, Dan here with another quick uh, Omnibus review. I should have reviewed these long before, but I cut, was a little hesitant because I have to admit, I started reading the Rick and Morty comics before I even saw the show. Yeah, I know, that sounds kind of weird and probably sounds bad to a lot of you, especially if you searched YouTube and came across this video because you're fans of Rick and Morty, the show. Yeah. <laughs> I'll admit, um, I kind of had friends who kind of like talked about the show, but I never really watched it. I didn't really watch it until I started reading the books. I read the books because they seem kind of interesting, and they are kind of funny, so they made me want to go and binge watch the show, and I binge watched all three seasons, and yeah, I like the show too. <laughs> so I've, I've read number of these. I think it's kind of cool how like... But omnibuses especially, like, they have, like, a sound chip in them, so when you open the cover it says stuff. But mainly, the comics are not a rehash of the series on Adult Swim. What they are is they feature, like, different adventures that certain characters from the show have gone on. Like, if you know who PB is, I'm not going to say his name because it sounds kind of silly saying it in a YouTube video. But he has, they give like a little background on this character. And I know, like he appeared in one episode, I think it was in season two. And we weren't sure if he was a figment of Rick's imagination or what. But then he usually appears at the end of seasons and kind of gives you a rundown. And says, ooh -wee, what did you think about that season? You know, like stuff like that. So I thought it was kind of interesting that they did feature him in a number of issues. Um, this was good, but it wasn't great, I will have to admit, um, I did rate this 3 out of 5 stars on Goodreads. It's worth picking up if you are a fan of the Rick and Morty TV show. Um, would I go ahead and collect these and want to keep them on my shelves? No, not necessarily. And, um, Omnibus 3 collects issues numbers 21 through 25 of the comic book series. But yeah, like I said, it has fun little features like the... You know, like when you open the covers, that's what's the fun thing, the fun little factor when it comes to the omnibuses. I will have a link down below to purchase a copy of this if you're interested in checking that out. If you're a fan of the series, whether it be the comic, the TV series, or both, leave me a comment down below telling me who's your favorite character. If you like the video, like it, share it with your friends. If you're not a subscriber and you're looking for more graphic novel trade paperback comic book type reviews. I do do regular book reviews too, um, just not as often or frequently as I do the comics. Hit that subscriber button and while you're there, hit that notification bell. Thanks for watching guys. Until next time, later.